In this process, I'm going to show you exactly how to unlock a Fado Motorola L2. Now, I'm going to use a Motorola V3 for this process, but the steps are the exact same for both phones. The unlock process. So now, the first thing you need to do is you need to put a not allowed SIM card in. Uh, what a not allowed SIM card is basically any other network than the original network. This is a Rogers phone. So what I'm doing is I'm putting a T-Mobile SIM card in it. Uh, Rogers is in Canada, T-Mobile is in the U.S. It doesn't matter what network. Um, now, it doesn't necessarily have to be the SIM card that you're going to use with the phone. Like, uh, for example, the T-Mobile SIM card I put in actually does, it doesn't even have a live line on it, but it will work. So at this point, you've gone to globalunlock.com, you've gotten your unlock code, and you are ready to go. Um, a couple things. You may get a contact service provider message. That means that you've tried the wrong code too many times. We've got ways to get around that. Uh, so don't worry about that message. Uh, now you've got enter subsidy code. So what you need to do right now is you need to enter the subsidy code into the phone. So I'm going to enter the one, again, it's unique for this phone, so it's not going to work on your phone. Uh, and you can't even see it. You can see what I'm typing. 30999847. So once you've done that, you click the top corner here, it says OK. Watch what happens. Now it shows Fido. Now it shows the number that was actually on the SIM card. Actually, I do apologize. It was a Fido. This is a Fido phone, which is owned by Rogers. So now it's searching for the network. It's not going to find a network. Uh, would you like to personalize? No. So what's going to happen here is you're actually able to enter into the menu. So that actually shows that the phone has been unlocked. Where before, same T-Mobile SIM card that is in there, um, when I put that in, you were not able to actually make calls uh, with this phone. It's an enter subsidy code. Now that you're actually able to do that. Uh, thank you very much. We hope you really enjoyed this video. Go to globalunlock.com and uh, get your phone unlocked if you haven't already got the unlock code. And if you have, thank you very much uh, for your business. And I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Take care. I'm Nick Riccardi. And I'm Rob Riccardi. And we're from Providence, Rhode Island. And uh, I have a Blackberry. And I have a Blackjack. And we recently switched to T-Mobile. And our phones, which are from AT&T, did not work for that. So we went to globalunlock.com. We got our codes. We typed them in. And now it works great. So thanks a lot. And keep up the good work. Thank you. Hi, my name is Amanda. I'm from Long Island, New York. And I unlocked my phone with Global Unlock. I have a BlackBerry Pearl A120, which is with T-Mobile. Um, and I want to use an AT&T SIM card on it. Um, so I placed an order in on Saturday night. And it, they said it would come within one to three days. And it came first thing on Monday. I got the email with the code and video and instructions. And they made it really easy to unlock my phone. And I would definitely use their service again.